Hi everybody, it's the Intuitive Healer and today I'll be doing a reading for the sign of Aries. So let's go ahead and tune your energy, Aries. For those of you stopping by for the very first time, welcome to my channel and I hope you enjoy this reading. For those of you that are already part of the Intuitive Healer Tarot family, welcome back my loves. And thank you so much for your love, your support, and your donations. I appreciate you. All right, we have the Judgment card. Our first card that I really want to talk about here is our middle card. It says willingness. It says you are able to compromise if the end result is love. And here we have the devil card. All right. This looks like something happened in the past uh, that kind of transitioned a lot of things that are actually taking place at this time. So I think that it would be good to say that um, a major shift has happened. Ooh, five of wands. Yeah, all right. Wheel of Fortune. We continue here. Ascended Masters, Angels, Guides, those that have crossed over, please guide me to the right messages for Aries. Ooh, I keep popping out here. We have three of wands. We have the eight of pentacles. We have the seven of wands. And our seven of cups. Queen of cups. Nine of Wands, and our Two of Pentacles. Mm, there's some good energy going on here, even though it kind of looks a little on the dark side here. You know, here's a card that talks about the past. Talks about a situation that could very well be happening in the present moment as well. Maybe there's a person that you have been with that was kind of a repeat offender. Not sure why that's coming in. Maybe they were in jail a lot. Or they were just really rebellious and unruly. But that judgment's coming back around. And this person has to pay attention to what's happening here. There was temptation. Maybe this individual had an eye for others as well as you. Maybe this person was always looking for the next best thing. That's what the devil says. And I think because that person was always looking for the next best thing, there was a lot of fighting in the relationship. Five of Wands could have been a third party. Not sure, but there are three people. Could have been with somebody that started issues in a maybe a situation that you guys were maybe volunteering together and they just started some drama. Or maybe you had a job together and they were starting some drama. There's a lot of fighting behind the scenes. Wheel of Fortune said somebody got tired of it and the universe heard the cries of help, came in to rescue you, moved things around to your favor. That's what happens. The universe hears it all. Here's it all. It doesn't go by anything, you know. We have the Nine of Wands. Powerful energy. Standing in your truth. Not wavering. This is what it is now. 
Three of Wands, you took a different path, Aries. You changed a path. You went towards your highest and best path, and that was towards love. Willingness to compromise, willingness to be passionate about life again. Three of Wands said you took ownership. Not to say that you didn't get hurt along the way, Eight of Pentacles. Or that you were blinded by certain things that happened because maybe you were, but we all learn, right, Aries? Don't be hard on yourself. I love you guys. Seven of Wands. Standing up for what you believe. Standing up for your truth. Again, not wavering. Because you knew that you at some point were going to be in a different position. You started seeing the beauty in yourself. Seven of Cups. Loving yourself, listening to your higher truth. That's how you got in the Queen of Cups position. Just saying, just saying. Knight of Wands moving towards a better future. Hallelujah, right? Two of Pentacles enjoying what you've planned and being excited about it. See what I mean? But that's also been a slow moving energy. I think I wanna pull some more cards here. I think I want four more. Send it masters, angels and guides guide me to the right cards for my lovely Aries. have six of pentacles i think this is you maybe in the past you were sitting in a dream state with this person maybe looking through rose colored glasses not really seeing the truth not seeing that this person was just like indulging in the temptations yeah but it's time for you to indulge and it not be a temptation, but be a truth, right? Ooh, the hermit, of course, be a truth. So going within, being very introverted, not knowing what to do. What do I do? I don't know what to do. He never says the lessons you learned pave the way for what you need to do. Listen to your higher heart. Two more cards, please. All right, we have the strength card. See, you were strong enough to prevail. Because you listen to your higher guidance. It's a good thing. Sometimes we gotta learn those harsh lessons, but whatever, whatever. The magician, well, you knew there was some deceit and some nonsense. That's why you pulled out of that game and you're like, game over people who are you who are you because i know who i am but who are you right it's a weird thing aries all right let's pull from our angel answers cards here And masters, angels, and guides, guide me to the right cards for my lovely Aries. Let it be in the highest, best for all. <sighs> all right, we have within the next few months. Yeah, I, th I think that love's going to come in for you guys that are single Aries out there. Passion comes in. That's kind of an inclination as some loving coming in right Aries meditation brings answers everything you need is within everything you need is within just saying recovery yep 
healing time. Healing time from all the nonsense of the past. It's okay. Got a few months. It says within the next few months that love's going to come in. But it's recovery time right now. For them or for you or whoever's involved. I said, is love here? Yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. See what I mean? See what I mean? I can't make this stuff up. You guys saw me pull these cards. Romance. Boom. Told you guys we're all matching up to our beloveds. That's what's going down. Don't be scared. Do your work. Don't drag shit from the past into the future. Usually don't cuss, but I have to say time to take action in a better direction of course it is right Aries what are you guys doing get out of those emotions get out of those emotions get into positive emotions and choose a new direction towards love all right, let's go ahead and get into our romance angels. Yeah, you know, I think you have the willingness right now to move forward. I think you are going to choose a different direction. Yeah, look at this. Whoa, this could be the one. So do your healing. This could be the one. Yeah, I'm telling you. Let your friends help you, help, help you get to a better space. Ask for and accept support from them. Maybe go on hikes with them. Maybe spend some time with them. Heal family issues now. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So doing the inner work, doing the inner child work. So what is called of you right now, Aries? And then you get your love and your romance. Got to let go of some control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. For those of you that are in a current situation, Aries, you better get out of there if it's a bad one. If it's a good one, well, guess what? You guys are going to be getting to different places with each other in forgiveness and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. So universe is allowing that closure that reconciliation and new love for those people that aren't in a partnership right now new love for you because you're doing the work right aries because you want some passion yeah you do it's all good time to go and retreat it's time to disconnect from the world and go within asking those very difficult questions on how to navigate your life past that situation that was so brutal because you deserve love you are lovable so you better know it mm -hmm, aries you are lovable so enjoy the new love coming in and enjoy all of the new stuff that's coming in for those that are learning these valuable lessons. So look, passion. <laughs> Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Boom. Just like I said, Aries. Going to be passionate. I'm going to pull one more card for you guys. Because I know you guys are like, what? So... See, release your ex. Time has come to clear your energy because there's new love coming. All right. So if you guys want to get into this reading a little bit deeper, all my information's down there in that description box below on how to do that. So book soon because I only have a short window that it's open for my readings. For those of you that haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell and you'll be notified when my new videos do come up. And as always, I am here to support your highest best. You know, you got romance coming and look at this. Perfect timing. Take action. There's a new direction.
I don't know. That looks really good, Aries. So make sure you guys have that notification bell on uh, because I will be giving away crystals, smudge sticks, and tarot cards for my lovelies. So enjoy all the happiness and all the passion coming your way. And namaste.